Coffee lovers, listen up. A new first-of-its-kind center is bolstering research around many Americans' favorite drink. Ted Lindner has a closer look. Hot or iced, sweetened or black. No matter how Americans take their favorite cup of joe, data from the National Coffee Association reveals U.S. adults consume more java each day than any other type of drink. Oh, wow. Isn't that something? Yeah. But researchers at the University of California, Davis, say scientific studies centered around coffee are lacking compared to alcoholic beverages like wine. What I'd like to convey is it's actually more difficult to make a good cup of coffee than it is to make a good bottle of wine. And when I say that to my wine colleagues, they get all riled up because they know how difficult it is to make wine. It turns out coffee is even more complicated. To perk up the buzz, the school recently opened its new coffee center. The nation's first academic facility dedicated to the science and art of coffee. The sprawling facility features various labs and roasting rooms where students can conduct chemical engineering and other research. We could control things like its acidity level. With a, by doing research and looking at how these parameters change as you roast, we'll be able to predict what's going to happen if you roast a certain way. All with the goal of helping advance the future of the coffee industry. We're trying to elevate coffee and make it uh, a topic of academic uh, research and an academic talent pipeline to help support the industry and help support what's arguably the world's most important beverage. Going forward, the UC Davis Coffee Center aims to add a greenhouse so they can grow beans on campus. Faculty there also hopes the university will offer a degree in coffee science in the future. Ted Lindner, Fox News.